Welcome back to Jerry King Live. I'm your host, Jerry King, and today on part three of our study of Mesopotamia, we're going to look at Arcadia and King Sargon I. I'd like to welcome back renowned historian, Dr. Archaeologist, to discuss this great time in history. Thanks, Jerry. Well, today I'd like to discuss the civilization of Arcadia and... Hey guys, sorry to interrupt your show, but did you see the Larry Springer show yesterday? His guests were the city-states of Samaria. Man, they were pulling hair, throwing chairs, and just fighting over land and water. That's crazy, man. They even called each other some ugly names. I can't even say them on here, they were so bad. Even I know that's not nice. It's a good thing Larry brought in King Sargon, and he was able to talk some sense into them. They all left happy and agreed to share and work together. You should go watch it. See you later, guys. King Sargon I showed up around 2334 BCE and led them for 50 years. He united the Sumerian city-states until 2279 BCE. They spoke a Semitic language with an Arcadian dialect during this time. Like the Sumerians before them, Arcadia fell in 1900 BCE to a rival nation known as Babylonia. But that's another story for another night. Thanks for joining us, Dr. Ologist. Until next week, we bid you good night and leave you with a word from our sponsor. Hello, ladies. This is Jill here for J&J &J Products to tell you about our new bubble bath. It's called Sargon, and it's the perfect way to end a stressful day. Sargon's special blend of aromas bring about a calming peace that will make you more agreeable with even the toughest person. One soak in our bubble bath and you'll be saying, Sargon, take me away.